Hindi ikaw, te. Sa akin, safe pa rin yung Hong Kong. Kasi, hindi pa diniklar na hindi safe. <laughs> Ang susunod na palabas ay kailangan ng patnubay ng mga magulang. Kung walang mga magulang, pwede naman ang kamag-anak. Kung walang kamag-anak, huwag ka nalang manood. Hello guys! This is Ate Chota B once again. I miss you all. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night, good morning to those who are for sleep. Um, yeah, naglalakad ako in the middle of nowhere because... na hindi ko kapisado for the first time in my whole life. Dinaanan ko siya kasi ganun katindi yung um uh, tawag to? Ganun katindi yung protest niya. Wala ka talagang masakyan kahit mga taxi ang hirap mong tunin. Tapos yung bus na dati naman papunta sa amin ay nasasakyan. Ngayon guys, as in, wala. Naka-standby silang lahat doon. Nakala ko kanina makakauwi na ako. Pero wala. Wala eh. So, ayun. So, yun nga guys, no? Sorry, I was interrupted because I asked someone if this is the right way to go to the street rather than I want to go to. Going to a place. right time para sabihin ko sa inyo or i-answer ko yung kasagutan ng iba. Safe po ba sa Hong Kong? Well, so far it is still safe. We are still safe sa ngayon. Kasi nga everything is still fine. And um, it's just that meron silang um, pinaglalaban, ba? Diba? So it's not our thing. I'm not the right person to tackle about it. But I just wanna tell you. Hingal <laughs> ako, I'm sorry. That's quite high and long though. I walked already for like about 45 minutes. Oh, there's a missing dog. Help. Missing dog. I'm sorry guys. I am being interrupted again. Yeah. Again, I want to answer the question, if are we safe here? Well, at the moment, we are safe because since the first day that they started the protest, rally, never, never experienced or encountered um, being harassed or something. Ayan, ano sa palagay mo? Safe ba? Safe pa ba ang Hong Kong or hindi na? Safe pa naman. Safe pa naman? Sa palagay ko. Okay. Ikaw sis? Hindi. Hindi na? Why? Elaborate. Explain. <laughs> <laughs> Dahil sa rally. Hindi. Ikaw? Safe pa naman siguro. Siguro? Siguro. Walang pa kasiguro. <laughs> Ikaw, Mr. Victor? Maybe. Safe na safe. Ba, talagang ano siya? Wala lang kay Lord. Confident? Yes. Yeah. Sino pa ba? May natutulog. Ikaw sis Emma? <laughs> Hala, ano daw? Magtutoothbrush pa siya para namang maaamoy nila yun. Wala. Sa akin, safe pa rin yung Hong Kong kasi hindi pa diniklar na hindi safe. Tama naman, di ba? Oo. Tama naman. Wala tayong ipagka-worry kasi sa ngayon pa lang safe. Paano masabi? Safe ang Hong Kong. Pag nag-declare na war, yun. Eh, uwi na tayo. Yun na. Sure ka? Uwi ka talaga? Siyempre naman, namiss ko yung asawa ko. Aray, chariot. Namiss ko yung apu ko. Uwi na sa akin. Namiss ko yung asawa ko. Paano na yung asawa ko? Siyempre naman, asawa. Namiss ka ba ng asawa mo? Ang tanong. Hindi ko alam. Ikaw, te. Sa palagay mo, safe pa ba ang Hong Kong? Ikaw, te. Sa palagay mo, namiss ka ng asawa ba? Te. Yun ba ulit ang tanong? Namiss ko na, te. 
Safe pa ba ang Hong Kong o hindi na? Oh, safe, safe pa, pa di ba? Confident! Confident silang sumagot. O, oh, di ba? Safe na safe, di ba? Wala tayong takot, di ba? Wala lang naman takot. Tayo kasama. Ayan. My way is not affected. My way of going home is not affected. So, there's a lot of bus here. Yeah, we're not, you know, we are safe. I can really say that we are safe because we are not involved in the problem. I mean, uh, it's their thing. And the only tip that I can say to my fellow OFWs here, you know, the, every time there is a protest, there is a police advisory to keep away from the place where the protest is happening. So if you'll just obey that, then everything will be fine. And, you know, just obey your employer's advice too. Like if they will say, okay, come back home early as possible, you know, everything will be okay. They're not after us, guys. It's it's an issue of uh, government and their people. We don't uh, get involved with their matters. Oh, after a long walk, guys. After a long walk. Finally Just woke up 